Hi everyone, it's Tyler with Gray Trunk RFID. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to locate a specific asset using our handheld reader and our RFID tags that we have applied to our assets. So if you have a ton of assets laying around and you're looking for one specific RFID tag or one specific asset, stay tuned. I'm gonna show you how to find that specific asset using our RFID reader. So have you ever been just searching for an asset and you know that it's somewhere around a room or a building? Well, today I'm gonna to go over a feature here with you uh, in the Great Trunk app called our Locate feature. In the RFID world, this is also known as a Geiger counter as well. Basically, it's a hot cold uh, mechanism that will tell you how close you are to an RFID tag to a specific RFID tag that you put into the system to search for. It's like a hot cold, it's sort of like a you know treasure hunt as well, so when you get closer, it gets louder uh, the closer you get to it because the strength of the RFID signal is stronger the closer you get to that asset that you're looking for. So now I'm gonna jump into our app here, and I'll show you this on the screen. What I'm gonna do is search for a specific asset tag ID. So for this instance, I'm gonna be looking for our printer here in the office, which you can see just over my shoulder here. On the screen, I'm gonna be looking for asset tag ID number 4913, which is the barcode RFID tag that we have attached to the printer. From here, I can see the item that I'm looking for. I'm gonna hit the locate tag, and it brings up this bar. Basically, this bar will give you a visual and an audible noise, meaning that I'm catching that RFID tag. So I'm pointing toward back over here, and I'm picking up that RFID tag, which is about 25 feet away right now. I'll get a little bit closer, and you'll sort of see what happens. So just like that, I'm able to figure out exactly where an asset is. This is very useful if you haven't scanned an asset in a long time and you want to know where it's at. It helps you know and record your assets uh, so, you can, so you can have record of them knowing that they're in the area that they're supposed to be. Once you find it, you can update the location from there as well. Uh, but this is just a very useful tool that we use uh, within Graytrunk to help locate specific assets whenever you need to find something. So uh, it's a very neat feature within the RFID space. I just wanted to show it to you today. So I, I hope this video helped explain how the locate feature or the Geiger counter works for RFID when searching for a specific asset. If you've made it this far, please like, subscribe, and comment on this channel. Uh, if there's anything that you would like to know about in the RFID world. We'll be posting videos regularly, so please join us. Uh, give us a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. It really does help our channel. Thank you for joining us today, and stay tuned for some more videos coming up in the coming weeks.